Welcome, 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 beautiful Paris Saint Germain family to boy PSG. And recently, some you know heartbreaking news have been dropping for the upcoming Champions League game between Paris Saint Germain and Girona, and we're here to discuss all of them. Here's the first report regarding Gianluigi Donnarumma. Breaking: Gianluigi Donnarumma is out for the match versus Girona as he suffers from a muscular discomfort in his right thigh. The club announces, so it's completely confirmed. Gianluigi Donnarumma will not feature versus Girona. Obviously, Gianluigi Donnarumma, one of the best goalkeepers in the world, one of the best players in the Paris Saint-Germain squad. So it would definitely be a blow not having Gianluigi Donnarumma. But that is the reason we bought Matviev Safanov. That's the reason we kept Arnaud Tenas. And that's the reason you do have squad depth because of situations like this. No player is going to be healthy for the entirety of the season. That is just a normal thing. And that is why you plan and do stuff in the beginning. So... This now gives answer to the people that were questioning the signing of Matviev Safanov in the summer, because according at least to Le Parisien, who are the first, you know, I don't know, newspaper to try to guess, they have reported Justin Matviev Safanov is expected to start versus Girona in the Champions League on Wednesday. And the thing is, I still feel this is a guess from uh, Le Parisien. I don't think they can already know who's going to be the goalkeeper. I don't think Lutra has mentioned it or talked about it. But it's obviously between Matviev Safanov and Arnaut Tenas. Arnaut Tenas has obviously played previously with Paris Saint-Germain. Matviev Safanov has only played preseason, one game with Paris Saint-Germain. So it would be interesting to see who is the starting goalkeeper. If I had to guess who's going to be, maybe Safanov. I mean, we signed him. There's a reason behind him. But there's also a reason that Lutru kept Arnaut Tenas. So at the moment, I don't really know. I think you can make an argument for both goalkeepers. Safanov was signed. As the backup goalkeeper, Safanov was told you will even be competing for the first spot, which is obviously a lie, but I mean, if he doesn't get minutes here, how is he going to be competing for the first spot? So if I had to pick one, I think it would be Safanov, but don't be surprised if Arnaut Tenas is the starting goalkeeper in the game. And now we're going to take a look at the second report which dropped. More bad news. Warren Zara Emre made his return to the group and took part in this morning training session. Vitin has yet to make his return to collective training and obviously... You don't want to hear this as a Paris Saint-Germain fan. Vitinha, our best midfielder, is not going to be playing this game. No one likes that. No one likes that. I, I want Vitinha to play. Vitinha is our best midfielder. One of our best players so far. Last season. Especially this is a big Champions League game. And, you know, you want that comfortability and so on. But once again, that's why we have midfield depth. That's why we have, I don't know, six possible midfielders that I'm comfortable with starting for Paris Saint-Germain. And Warren Zara Emery, it's good that he's recovering well uh, and should be in the squad for the game versus Girona. I still feel Vitina could be in the squad. There's a high probability, but none of them are going to start. That is 100%. So here I'm going to tell you who's going to be the starting midfield. And I think it's going to be the exact same midfield we saw yesterday versus um, Brest, obviously. So Fabio Ruiz, Joao Neves, double pivot and Kange Lee. That three-man midfield looked good yesterday and they will have to look good versus Girona. But yeah. Those are the reports that have dropped. And as I said, I think it will be Safanov that starts in goal instead of Donnarumma. And it will be Joao Neves paired up with Fabio Ruiz and Kangi Lee instead of Warren Zara, Emre and Vitinha. Even though I feel both Warren and Vitinha will be in the squad for the game, just not starting the game. That's been it from your boy PSG. Let me know in the comments down below what would be your midfield three. And would you start at Rautenas or Gianluigi Donnarumma? That's been it from your boy PSG. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. And as usual, allez, allez, allez Paris.